Captain on the bridge. Good evening, sir. What is it, number one? The relief escort is in sight, coming down from the north. Signal her again. Aye, aye, sir. Hang on, she's altering course. Oh my god. It's a battleship. A bloody Nazi battleship. It's an astonishing tale. They go through the most unimaginably horrific circumstances. The courage and the, the determination to just stay alive. A ship that just wouldn't sink, that should have sunk. It's incredible, really. The peril that him and his crew have been put through means that he has to survive by relying on others, and he realizes that others rely hugely upon him, and he uh, has to pick up the mantle and mature and survive. We're in the lee of that. God Almighty! Hang on! Hang on with everything you have! He's a sort of character that doesn't exist anymore, you know, an honorable man. When people were more honorable, it was a time of honor. We want to give them their reward. Damn them! Both would be at the bottom of the ocean if it wasn't for those men. I played Charles Pollard, who is the chief engineer of the San Demetrio. And he, like a kind of extraordinary number, I think, of his crew, is someone who just gets on with it. Second mate, I've had enough of this bollocks. Start making decisions and show these men some bloody leadership. Like, she, she really has a fight about her that's really inspiring. Can't begin to compare chugging around in those scruffy old tubs to real fighting. Bringing that, well, my experience of, like, having to fight and defend myself and the people I care about. And if he doesn't get through, then those planes won't be able to fly and we lose the war. Brought me It seems that your husband's lifeboat has not been found. So now it's your boat's turn. Let us show the world what he can do. There's a ship! Oh, my sweet Jesus. It can't be. I have to get them home. Come back to me, Arthur. Piccoli in there! Piccoli! That's mine! Captain coming through! I can't believe you pulled that off, Captain! fascinating story. The best side of British seamanship. Understanding what those men went through, it's kind of mind-blowing, really. And they just keep going. Get her out of there before the Nazis find her.